Hi, this is Trey Passer, and this is my video entry to Cinefro 355, his Blu-ray giveaway contest. He's giving away um, season one, I believe, on Blu-ray of um, Boardwalk Empire. Um, first of all, congrats, um, Chad, on on the 200 subs. Um, um, I really like your channel. I love that you, sh you know, when you shoot your video, you see all your movies in the background, and I love the lights. And when you have it, you know, you had it in the dark. I've seen your most recent videos. You had the, I guess the, I guess you have it, you know, where your collection is. You have it lighted, you know, the lights are on it. It looks great, actually, in the video. And anyway, and, and you always pick up the great things. And you're great. You have great movie knowledge. And I love that you get the old time movies. The thing with me is sometimes, you know, I, I'm all over the place with movies. Um, no, but you seem to have specific goals of, of movies that you get and you, Get, pick up the fantastic things, and I'm in awe of, and I hope to be like you one day. Which, like I say, because you get fantastic old movies, new movies, Criterion, just you know, just I just love your collection. Let me just say that, okay? And okay, you're giving away, um, like I said, the Boardwalk Empire on Blu-ray. Like I said, um, I didn't watch the first season of Boardwalk Empire, um, but the I had these people at my job, the guys I work with, they started talking about it, and so I started watching season two and I absolutely love it. And um, so I would love to get season one and see what I missed. <laughs> like I said, so that's a great prize. And thank you again for giving back to the community. And maybe, like I said, I'll leave a link to your channel down below. And may you have 200 more subs. You know, exactly. Because you're very knowledgeable. And, and I think everybody should at least tune into your channel because you always do very good. You know, you're, when you do your updates and stuff. And you talk about movies, it's, you can tell that you have such great knowledge and you're a great access to, not access, <laughs> excuse me, great asset to the movie community. Okay, now you ask two questions in your contest and you can do a text response or a video response. I did a text response. No, no, no. Yeah, you can do a text response and a video response. I'm doing a video response. Okay, and you ask two questions. The first question is um, what's your collecting goals for 2012? Okay, for me, um, I'm trying to get the uh, the, Dixie, the Disney Pixar animated movies, like you know, like Rat Ratatouille, uh, Monsters Ball, um, uh, The Incredibles, uh, and a few others, you know, that I can't think of at the top of my head. But yeah, you know, but you know, Disney movies are always expensive. But I'm, but my goal <laughs> for 2012, one of my goals, is to try to get all those uh, Disney Pixar animated movies because I absolutely love. The uh, I love, especially love the Pixar ones. They're just fantastically the illustration and this, this you know, in high definition watching those. It's just fantastic. And so I would like to get all of them on Blu-ray. And my and another one of my goals is to try to get um. See, I try to get complete. I'm trying to be a completist. I know some people say that a completist. I'm trying to get like all the I got all the Halloween movies, all the. Friday the 13th movies and all the Nightmare on Elm Street movies. I would like to get those, but see, like I said, I jump all over the place when I go to um, Best Buy and and when I go to Target and and um, and the, I forgot the in Walmart. I just I'm sometimes it's all over the place, you know, getting movies and I you know I pick up from different sources. But I want to try to be more consistent. Like like when I go shopping, just have a theme and just like say, okay, I'm going to pick up these horrors. I'm going to pick up these action or pick up this comedy. I like to be more consistent that way, but I just sometimes I just, you know, like I said, I like, you know, when I go I go movie shop, I just grab what I want to grab. So I'm sounding like a, like I said, I'm a great impulse buyer. I see what I want and I grab it and I do that. But I want to try to be more consistent with pulling the movies, you know, like getting a theme, like, oh, see, I'm going to get these horror movies today. I'm going to get, get Criterion's, or I'm just going to get TV shows or whatever. Just try to be more consistent. That's what one of my goals, you know. For 2012. Okay, and the second question you ask is, what's the oddest thing that you collect? Um, that's kind of hard for me. I was trying to think. I don't think I collect anything odd or unusual. Um, I collect uh, comic books, and that's not unusual. I don't think a lot of people collect comic books. That's normal. And, uh, and another thing I collect, which uh, you see these two Terminator heads, I like like movie prop things. I, li I like. So that's why I got the, term the T2 head that's over there, and the Terminator Salvation Head, which is back that way, and I also have uh, uh, the from the Dark Knight. I have the Bat Pod, the the 
you know, the um, Blu-ray that comes with the bat pod in it, and then I have the the, um, the one that comes with the, the Dark Knight collectible from Best Buy that comes with the clown mask and the, uh, the I think the uh, Target exclusive one with the Batman mask for Dark Knight. Okay, and I like, and also I'm gonna try to get. I, I talked about this before in my other, my previous in my previous videos. I'm dying to get the Thor helmet with the blue gray steel book, <laughs> and also I want to get the uh, the 300 Spartan helmet with the collectible set that comes with. Because I want those are two things. So I like collecting movies. I don't know if that's odd though, but that's what I'm gonna pick. I like uh, getting movie things. I guess, and you know, movie props. I guess you can say. Uh, or you know, movie props. I like I like those. So I guess that would be. I don't I don't think that's odd, but okay, that's my choice, and I hope it's good enough for you. Okay, and like I said, um, please sub to uh, Cinefro 355's to his channel. I'll leave a link again below. He's a great guy, and like I said, he's very knowledgeable. He always gets like the best movie. His co his collection must be fantastic because I always he has movies from the 40s, the 50s. He has current movies. He has Criterion's, and just. You could you could tell he's just he's a serious movie collector and, and his, his collection has to be epic, and he's totally worth the the sub. Please sub to him, okay? So this is Trey Passer saying, so long and take care.